Quit being a punk. What a beautiful rainbow. Thick one. Well, judging by the zombie character you see here, we have the Inu today. And I got a little fresh little puck here with the fresh homemade leader on it. This one's made up to be for kind of Euro nymphing. So there's a little less of uh, the real backing, which is this white section. There's a little less of that and a little bit longer in uh, run of tippet coming off of it. So usually the setup on my leader is, is it's two thirds of the rod length is real backing so if it's a 13 foot rod it'd be like eight foot or so of uh real backing and then stepping down from like depending upon what the rod's set for like tippet wise i usually go zero two and four or one three and five depending upon what the rod needs to be at so if it's a 5x rod it'll be a one three five and each section will be 14 to 18 inches long depending upon what I am trying to achieve with the fishing of it. As in if I'm trying to nymph it or if I'm trying to throw dries or if I'm trying to strip a streamer. Each one has its own variance. But all of them start out with the same step down three piece leader. It's just the only thing that's kind of changing up is the length of uh, sections of leader. So three at 14, three of them at 18. Plus uh, two thirds of the rod will get you the whole length of the rod. So anyways, here we are. This great rod looks wonderful. Feels great in your hand. It feels good to hold it up front. Feels good to hold it in the back. Let's get a couple drifts in and see if we can achieve finding something. I think I'm going to try making a few casts through this real quick over here. Bang. Called it. Called it. Called it. Bang, baby. What a beautiful fish. Look at that thing. Come on. Oh, yeah. What a beaut. Look at that thing. I wish Clark was here to see it. Hmm. Oh, and you pulled that one right out of there. Let's make sure we're all. All right. That didn't take long, but here we have this beautiful rainbow trout. Didn't take long to get it in the net, get her out of the net, get her back in there. There she goes. Woo. Man. That was fun. That was uh, one of the biggest fish of the day. Right there. Oh boy. One of the biggest fish of the day followed up by another big fish. I'm gonna keep spinning. 
keep spinning. Get back over here. I like it when they spin. Oh boy. <laughs> oh man. Fairy bee is for the wind today. Look at that thing. Oh, the fish. Let's get our hands wet. Oh, man. Super feisty, super impressive rainbow. Beautiful colors, look at them scales. Let's get her back. Woo! All right, all right. All right, all right. We can work with this. Let's see if we can get another one real quick. Nymphor. All I'm doing is nymphing it, single nymph. Working the seams as I'm making my way out. Oh, that one broke. No, that was a good one too. Big fish. All right, moving down to about here. This ought to be good enough. Let's see if we can get one more here. These fish are just beautiful right here. Spent all day playing with 12 inches. Now we're hitting good ones. I see some surface in action over here on this one side. Let's just run this right through this section real quick in front of me. That way I'm not spooking anything. Twelve in the net. We're barbless, so it should just come off here. Super feisty twelve or ten inch little devil. Right back in there. <laughs> 